We're going to do some sleepy time Reiki. I hope you guys are having a beautiful evening. Thank you. I'm going to use this Palo Santo to purify our aura. Thank you, Stacy. There we go. We'll feather this through. Cleansing and balancing that space. There we go, just like that. Beautiful. Thank you, Andrea. Thanks so much. All right. To receive this Reiki energy, all you have to do is give yourself permission to channel. Thank you. Thanks, Danielle. Thank you, Shama. So good to see you tonight. Thank you. There we go. And while we are working in the aura, creating balance, we are releasing any energies that have attached to the aura from the external world, releasing them, letting them go, letting go of any heaviness. Thank you, Marissa. Hi, Heather. Good to see you. Thank you, Sean. Thank you, Gabby. And we are just fluffing up that aura. Thank you, Danielle. Great to see you tonight. Thank you, Jessica Lynn. I'm going to continue combing through. Thank you, Danielle. Thanks so much. Through the aura. There we go. And I would like to do a little cord cutting here. When I cut these cords, I'm cutting attachments to heavy energy. Thank you, Shires. Anything that has been weighing on you, anything that's been heavy on you. Hi, Regan. Good to see you. 
Really cutting those, letting them go. Thank you, Brenda. Keeping the aura nice and spiritually fit. There we go. This is a really good exercise when you are empathic to release these. Thank you, Lindsay. Releasing these energies. Doing our cleanses are very important because we pick up energies from everybody. Thank you, Miss Susie Q. Good to see you. So when somebody is in our vicinity and they're having a bad day guess where that energy attaches that we can pick up a little bit of that onto our aura too sometimes we don't even know if somebody's having uh thank you cassandra a bad day thank you barbara so when we pick those up sometimes we feel very heavy and we don't understand why also, sometimes others can have bad feelings towards us and we may have no idea what's going on, but that energy is being put towards us so our aura can pick up on that too. So we're cutting those cords as well. Just the energy, not the person, not the attachment, but the energy and the emotion that goes along. Thank you, Jackie. There we go. This should help you feel lighter. Just like that. Thank you, Oil. Thank you, Ollie. Thank you, Brenda. Thank you, Barbara. There we go. Thank you, Singing Chick. Happy summer. Aw. Thank you, Lori Ray. Thanks so much. Thank you, Income. Here we go. Thank you, Amy. Thanks so much. Good to see you tonight. There, just like that. Thank you and come in. Thank you, Cassandra. a little plucking here and then we're going to move to that crown chakra oh thank you thank you amy thanks so much thank you singing chick thank you dash good to see you Thank you, Jackie.
Let's take a nice deep breath in here. Washing away the stress of the day. Very good, just like that. Thank you, old school. I love those. Thank you, Monica. Thanks, Tammy. Thank you, Glory Bay. Hi, Simona. Good to see you. Thank you. Let's allow that energy to lift now in that aura. Thank you, Kim. Just allow it to lift. Thank you, Kanisha. There we go, just like that. Thank you, Brenda. Thank you, Alan. There we go. Thank you, Hippie We are going to move into that crown chakra now. It's going to be his little clear quartz. And when I use this clear quartz, I'm just removing anything that's getting in the way of spirituality, maybe anything that's causing any anxiety, any doubt, maybe feeling a little blockage from the spirit of the sun. We're just going to remove that, feeling connected, tapping into gratitude, tapping into everything that's going right for you in life today. Maybe just breathing today, taking a nice, healthy, deep breath in is something that's going right. 
Thank you, Jason, for resubscribing. I appreciate that. Thanks so much. There we go. Let's get any dark energies out of there. Best feeling in the world is when you can connect with spirituality, whether that's source energy, higher power, God, whatever you want to call it, whatever it is to you. When you can find trust, telling yourself, as Abraham Hicks would say, the universe is always working for me. In every situation, even when it's not pleasant, it's always working for you. It's always something beautiful. That's how we get there to this beautiful life. Thank you, Robin. Thank you, Anita. So sometimes when we really, really want something so badly, thank you, Emran. Thank you, Sammy. It might not be what the universe has in store for us. There's something always so beautiful, though, that it does have in store for us. So maybe we've put a lot of effort or a lot of love or a lot of work into something. But if it's not what's planned for us, then we have to remember that taking that path of least resistance is always going to pay off for you. It will. Remembering that we're not here to struggle, we're here to enjoy this lifetime. But trusting when times are tough, when there is a reason And what we're doing here with this clear course is for anybody that is going through a tough time, we are trying to gain more clarity, more clarity for what that universe has in store. And if you are very spiritually fit, and this is really good maintenance to stay connected, stay with one. Thank you so much, Emirat. Thank you. There we go. Beautiful. Thank you, Sandra. Whenever I'm in this crown chakra, I always get little messages, and I get this one quite often. Thank you, Stephanie. Is when you are feeling struggle, sometimes when you have self doubt. I know I used to have that a lot before I got connected with spirituality. Thank you, Nicole. I used to think, thank you, Jeannie. I used to think if there was a higher power, maybe that higher power or that spirituality, maybe I'm just not good enough for it. Thank you, Handful of Daisy. So good to see you. Thank you, Nicole. Thank you, Stephanie. And if I feel like I'm not good enough, then I'm unable to tap into all that it is. Thank you, Christina. Thank you, Camille. Thank you, Nicole. But when you understand, and sometimes when we're struggling, we're like, well, if there was a higher power or spirituality, source energy, why do I have to go through all of this? Like, I just can't catch a break. But when you connect and you trust, you're able to see a shift in your mind where you see all of the beautiful miracles that are working for you and the thing that I always channel here in this crown chakra is that your universe your source energy your higher power whatever that is to you is so freaking proud of you super proud of you for wherever you are at right now you're doing awesome your higher power is like rooting you on saying, go on, you got this, you know, look at how strong you are, look at all that you can do, you're freaking amazing, 
and if you're struggling it's like a loving parent a kind loving parent where you know when we watch our children struggle we're like I hope that they get it this time and they will get it I know that they will and sometimes that struggle that adversity is what is going to make them more determined and even stronger and so we kind of get excited for their life lessons and that's what our universe that's what source energy is always there rooting for us always wanting the best for us never disappointed in us never ever disappointed thank you Danielle. thank you boo radley thank you christina there we go And I love that I get to channel that. I love that that is the message that channels through me. Thank you, Mrs. Charger. Because it's a beautiful message. And it makes me love people even more and more and more because I think sometimes we don't see what everybody else is going through. Thank you, Ducky. We just see the final product. We see what they're putting out and we're so impressed and so amazed, but we don't think about the steps that it took for that person to get there. We just see that complete package or that incomplete package. And I think, you know, the fact that I get to get that message is special. Special to see fellow human beings and feel source energy saying, I'm so proud of them, each and every one of them. Thank you, Flava. Thanks so much. So that is the message that channeled through me tonight, and I'm grateful. Here we go. Thank you, Brittany. Good to see you. There we go. Thank you, Danielle. Thank you, Kelsey. Thanks so much. Thank you, Leslie. Thank you, Joyce. Thank you. Thank you, Leslie. Thanks so much. Oh, you're so sweet. Thank you, Leslie. Hi, Liz. So good to see you. Thank you. Thanks, Danielle. Thank you, Kelly. There we go. Thank you, Sarah. Thanks so much. There we go. Oh, thank you, Brittany. Thank you. Those are so beautiful. Thanks so much.
Thank you, Kimberly. Thank you. Thank you, Nicola. Thank you, Stephanie. Thank you, Cakes. Thank you, West June. Thank you. Thank you, Sweet Peas. There we go. Thanks, Jane. Thank you, Lori. Thanks so much. Thank you guys for all those beautiful gifts this evening. There we go. Oh, good to see you, Pearl. Thank you so much. Thank you, sweet pea. Oh my goodness, thank you guys for all of those shares. Wow, thank you. Thank you for all of the likes, I appreciate it. Thanks so much, Christina. Thank you. Thanks, Christina. Thank you, Mama Steph. Thank you, Sirius. going to use some selenite and then we'll move into that third eye. Oh, thank you, Mama Steph. Thank you, Sandra. Wow, 
Thank you guys for sharing this. That means so much to me. Thank you, Gabriella. Thanks so much. Thank you, Lucia. Thank you, Freda. Thank you, Evian. Thank you, Estia. Thank you, Freda. Oh my goodness, we almost have 200 shares. Thank you, guys. Thank you, Evian. Thank you, Patty. Thank you, Shell. Thank you, God. Thank you, Michelle. We are going to now enter into that third eye chakra. Thank you, everyone. to your intuition, trusting your intuition. I'm going to do some cord cutting here. You might feel pull. Sometimes people feel the pull all the way from the back throughout. Hi Storm, so good to see you. Thank you for being here. Thank you, Storm. Thank you, Gabriella. So we are going to cut those cords. Anything that's blocking your intuition. Thank you, Lady T. And these can be intrusive thoughts, ruminating thoughts, things that limiting thoughts, things that are telling you, no, that just doesn't make sense but your gut feeling is super strong. You should always trust that gut. It's very connected to the universe. And the universe and your intuition are a perfect team of what is best for you. Thank you, sweet peas. And sometimes your inner voice, your intuition is so in tune with what the universe has in store for you. And that's why we get those red flags or we do something that we're like, this feels impulsive, but it feels like it's the right thing to do. And really it's not impulse, it's your intuition guiding you. Thank you, Richard. Thank you, Patty. How many times in your life did you just trust your gut feeling and you were like, I'm just going out on a, going out on a limb and then the next thing you know it was the best decision that you could ever make that's your inner voice that is your gut that's your intuition there we go I'm going to use some amethyst here, a raw amethyst, and we're going to see if we can pull any more dark spots 
off of that, anything that's blocking dark energies that are blocking that inner voice. When we do this, this also allows us to access mental clarity, it allows us to access perspective, perspective of self and perspective of others gives us the ability to step outside and see how we are responding to others and how they're responding to us so we can make better decisions and use better communication. Thank you, West June. There we go. Hi, Smar. So good to see you. Thank you. There we go. Thank you, guys. We're almost at 300 shares. I don't think that I've ever had this many shares. Maybe one other time. I appreciate it. Thank you, everybody. Thanks, guys. Thank you, Jean. Thank you, Samar. Thanks so much. Thank you. Thank you, Samar. There we go. Thank you, Amy. Thank you, Amy. Thank you, Sarah. There we go. Wow. Oh my goodness. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, everybody. That's so many shares. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, old school. Thank you, us June. Thank you, Cindy. Thanks, Cindy. Thank you, Anne. Thank you, Gabriella. Thank you, everybody. Thanks so much. Thank you, Anne. Thank you, Janelle. Thank you, love. Hi, Marla. Good to see you tonight. Thank you. Hi, Amanda. Great to see you. Thanks, guys. Thank you, guys. That's so many shares. Thank you. Thank you, Napco. Thank you, Amanda. Thanks so much. Hi, Cobra Craft. Thank you. Thank you, Amy. Thank you, Cobra Craft. Thank you, Amy. Thanks, Amy. Thank you. All right, I'm going 
to take the large selenite now and just run it over that third eye, cleansing it one last time. Thank you, cute little Luna. Thank you. Hi, Erica. Good to see you. I hope you're doing well. Thank you, Erica. Hi, Marissa. Thank you. Thank you, everybody, so much for being here this evening. All right. We are going to now move into that throat chakra. When we are working on the throat chakra, we are accessing healthy communication. There we go. Expressing yourself in a very kind, very compassionate way. By always expressing your needs, always expressing your wants. Thank you, Sarah. Because they are very important. Thanks, Sarah. Thank you, JD. Thank you guys. Oh my goodness, 600 shares. Thank you. Hi kids, thank you. Thanks guys. Thank you everybody for all of those shares. Thank you, Marissa. Thank you so much. There we go. Thank you, Miss Chris. Good to see you tonight. Thank you, Jude. Thank you. Thank you, Brittany. Thanks so much. I'm going to use a smaller selenite here in that throat chakra. Just removing anything that's blocking you from speaking your truth, anything that's getting in the way of you speaking what's on your mind, removing any blockages that are no longer serving you any purpose. Thank you, Jackie. 
anything that is getting in the way of you expressing those feelings. Thank you, Z. There we go. Thank you, guys. So while we are here, just thinking of people that you feel grateful for that are in your life. Thank you, Katie. Thank you, Danielle. Thinking of why you feel grateful that they are in your life. And here, we're going to imagine that that beautiful person is in your life that you feel so grateful for. And they're standing about 10 feet in front of you. And I want you to imagine first that they can read your mind. And you're thinking of all the good times that you have had with this person. All the good memories, all the good moments. Now I want you to imagine that you are expressing to this person all of the words that define who they are in your relationship with them. Are they loyal, compassionate, witty, funny, smart, strong, protective? What are those? Are they fair? Thoughtful? Imagine that you are telling them all of these feelings. Look in their eyes. You might see love. You might see tears. Happiness. You may see how much it means to them that you've expressed why you're grateful to have them in your life. There you go. Beautiful. going to take a nice deep breath in and allow that gratitude to flow through your body all the way down to your toes, down to your feet. Gratitude, feeling enjoyment, feeling love right now, hopeful. We are going to take another deep breath in and at this time we are going to tighten up every muscle in our body as we move down to that root chakra. And on the exhale, we are going to release the muscles only in our feet. Thank you. Keeping everything else nice and tight. As you feel your feet twice as relaxed, twice as absorbed. And we are going to now inhale again, bring the awareness, bring the focus into our calves, into our shins. And on the exhale, we are going to release those muscles in the shins and the calf twice as relaxed has absorbed. And now in the knees, releasing these joints, letting go of aches, letting go of pain, twice as relaxed, twice as absorbed. Let's take a nice deep breath in, filling up your abdomen and your hips and your waist. We're going to release these muscles along with the lower back twice as relaxed, twice as absorbed. And now 
breathing in again. We're going to take that focus and awareness to the ribs and the mid back, releasing those muscles twice as relaxed, twice as absorbed. And now bringing the focus, bringing the awareness to your chest, to your shoulders, your shoulder blades and your upper back, and now down the large muscles in your back. Twice as relaxed, twice as absorbed. And now we're going to take another deep breath in and we're going to relax the muscles down your shoulders all the way throughout your arms, through your hands, through the palms, and down through the fingertips, twice as relaxed, twice as absorbed. And now bring the focus and awareness to the neck to the face, the eyebrows, the forehead, the cheeks, the jaw, the nose, the mouth. Taking a nice yawn in here. Relaxing and exhaling twice as relaxed, twice as absorbed. So good for you. And now throughout the back of your head and your scalp. Letting all of that relaxation trickle down throughout your whole body, twice as relaxed, twice as absorbed. Very good. And now we are going to imagine every single muscle in your body magnified in deep relaxation times five. And now your whole skeletal system twice as relaxed, magnified times five. And now Imagining all of the cells in your body, all of the billions and billions of cells, each and every one of them, magnified in deep relaxation times five. Very good. And now your eyes and your eyebrows deeply relaxed times five. There we go, just like that. So sleepy and so relaxed. So sleepy and so relaxed. Very good. Thank you, Maggie. Thank you, Thank you, Anna. Thank you, Murphy. I hope you all are having a beautiful evening. Thank you, Maggie. Thanks so much. Thank you, Nicole. Thank you, Brittany. Thank you, Putty Mathianas. Thank you, Marla. So good to see you. Thank you. Aw, thanks. Aw, thank you, Nikki. Thank you so much. Good to see you. Thanks, Ivy. Thank you, Allie. Aww. Thank you, Alex. Thank you, Heather. Oh, you're so sweet. Thanks, Heather. Thank you, Jen. Thank you, Hippie. Thank you, Patty. So good to see you. Thanks, Maggie. Thank you, Denzi. Aw, thank you, Sean. Thank you. Thank you, Amunda. Good to see you. Thank you, Jane. Thank you, Christine. 
Thanks, Nikki. Thank you, Talk with Terry. Thank you. Oh, you guys are so sweet. Thank you, Marla. Thank you. Thank you, Natasha. Thank you, Boo Bradley. Good to see you. Oh, thank you, Amanda. Thank you, Christina. Thanks so much. Thank you, Marissa. Thank you, Mama Steph. Thank you, Amy. Thank you, Sarah. I'm so glad you're here. I hope you feel better. Oh, so good to see you, Erica. Thank you, West June. Hi, Reagan. Thank you. Thank you, Francisco. Thank you, Kevin. Oh, no, I'm not turning the comments off right now. It's the end. Thank you, though, Michelle. Thank you, Nikki. Thank you, Heather. Thank you. Thanks so much, Kevin. Thank you. Um, I'm hopping off now. Thank you, Mrs. Pablo. Thank you, Courtney. Thank you. Hi, Rocio. You're so sweet. Thank you, Mike. Thanks, guys. Thank you, me. Thank you, Carrie. Thank you, BB. Thanks, Erica. It was so good to meet you the other day. So, guys, I'm going to be at VidCon this week in California. Super excited. Thank you, Karen. That's actually why I have makeup on. I was trying to practice today. I haven't done this type of makeup for so long. Yeah, I could post this over there. Thank you, Yue. Thank you, Danny. Thank you, Amanda. I'm so excited. Oh, you're so sweet. Thank you, Jaffa. Thank you. Yeah, so if anybody is at VidCon, please, please say hi to me. I would love to see you guys. Um, yeah, it's in Anaheim. Super exciting. Thank you, Sarah. Thank you, Brittany. All right, so... Oh, you're so sweet. Thank you, User53. Thank you, Kelsey. Thank you. Um, vid, vid, VidCom, it's like, a, it's kind of like a, um, where they have like all kinds of YouTubers and TikTokers and, um, Instagrammers. It's supposed to be pretty cool. My kiddo wanted to go, so I thought it would be fun. I think we're, we're probably going to do that too, Western. Aw, sweet dreams, Sean. Thank you. Thank you, Ivy. Thanks so much. Yeah, I'm super excited. Super stoked. You're so sweet. Thank you, Tiwaz. You're so kind. So I'm going to hop off. I, what I'm going to do, I'm bringing my um, extra phone so that I can go live sometimes, but it's going to be very sporadic this week. I just wanted to let you guys know. Um, but yeah, I appreciate it. Sweet dreams, Patty. I want to hear more from you. I hope you're doing great. Thank you, Heather. You're so sweet. Thank you so much. Thank you, Max. Thank you. All right, guys. Well, we're going to end with our um, Reiki principles and then, and then call it a night. I hope you guys have beautiful dreams this evening. Thank you, BB. Thank you, Ivy. Thank you, Tiwaz. Thank you. Yay. Thank you, Patty. Thank you, Christina. Yeah, I'm going to be in, um, what's it called? California. Super exciting at the VidCon. I love your handle, Pixie Whispers. Okay, please repeat after me. Thank you. Just for today, I will not worry. Just for today, I will not anger. Just for today, I will live in gratitude every day. Just for today, I will work honestly. And just for today, I will be kind to all living creatures. Namaste. That's as easy it is that as it is, is I will be kind to all living creatures. All we have to do every single day is just wake up and be a freaking amazing good person, a kind person, a good person. That's all you have to do. 
and everything else will fall into place. Namaste. Take care. Sweet dreams. Love you all. Thanks. Thanks, Danielle. Thank you, Amanda. Thank you, Kevin. Thank you, Sarah. Thank you, Karen. Thank you, guys. Thank you, Yin Hippie. Thank you, Leisha. Thank you.